Greetings one and all, how's everyone doing? I hope very well. Please excuse the traffic background noise. Finding a quiet place to film today has been near impossible. I wanted to talk about the gas burner for the Trangia set. So this is my Trangia set. It's the 25.8. I've been uh, very happy with it. It was given to me by uh, YouTuber and someone I'm also subscribed to. The uh, channel name is I am Ito. He's always commenting. Very nice guy. I've already done a video on this, which I will link below if you want to go check it out. Now, of course, I do have. Uh, I do have, I did bring one just to show, but I've got the uh, Trangia stove along with a bottle of heat just to show you. Yeah, I do like using this system, but I found that when there are burn bands, I like the idea of just being able to turn off the burner. So the burner, just drop the tube through here and feed it through the side. So there's that. I'm going to be using the uh, kettle to boil a little bit of water. I'm going to make a cup of coffee. Uh, it just threads right onto the fuel canister. But, by the way, the gas burner was given to me by the uh, the real 11T, a friend, Facebook friend of mine, hell of a nice guy. Get a little, little water in the kettle. That's all prepared. So like I said in my uh, Bratwurst video, because we had fire restrictions, one nice thing is, is I had the flame over here, but I can just kill it from here. So I have a good, what, foot, maybe a foot and a half, foot and a quarter, away from the flame so I can just turn it off if I have to, and not have to get my hand close, or trying to drop a simmer ring on there, should, should things get out of control. Um, not that I was really worried that worried about it, but, you know, you never know. So. I mean, the operation is pretty simple. You know, crank it up, turn it down. It's a warm day. I'm making a, making a cup of coffee. Gonna make some, uh, Medagliodoro Instant Espresso. It's an aluminum table, so I'm not I'm not too worried about having the, the flame on there. And when the water's boiling, I'll bring it back.
Okay, so one thing I want to point out, first of all, the weight of the burner is uh, 6.3 ounces with the bag 6.8. And uh, this is not the Trangia brand burner. It's the one that you can get on eBay. I'll put a link down below so you can go check it out. Um, a lot cheaper, like the Trangia model was really expensive. Like I saw like $65 for the burner. And the real Levantine mentioned he'd saw seen one for about 200 which is like, I can't even imagine why they would spend, why they would charge so much, but you know, it is what it is. But I'm gonna link down below the, uh, the eBay link for this one. So, oh, already cool, cooled down. Yeah, I've really, really been happy with this set. And I've been really happy with the burner as well. So, I guess I'm kind of off camera, but. It's a nice little option. It's, if you don't want to use the uh, fuel, you can just use the uh, canister fuel. So, either canister fuels, or if you have the green bottle with the adapter, I'm sure you could set it on its side. It has a nice, uh, give you a close up. It's got this, so the fuel comes up and goes up in here and loops around, down, back down. And I heard that that's because in the, when it's cold out, the, uh, the burner will actually heat the line up. So, if I give you a, a nice close look at it. So there it is. All six point, I say 6.3 ounces? I wrote it down. Yes, I did. So 6.3 ounces. Just a really cool little burner. Simple, works great. Not not the uh, price that the Trangia guys want. I mean, I'm sure it's got. It's, I'm sure it's like tips the scale for quality, but it's a little bit more money that I'd want to spend. So, all right. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> oh, so again, I apologize for the traffic noise. Just you know, it happens. And uh, if you have any questions, ask in the below. Don't forget to check out I Am Ito or The Real 11T. And as always, I thank you for watching, and I'll catch you in the next one. So, in case you were wondering, these are just blue shop towels that I, I picked up. And what I do is I just I use them to keep the, uh, keep the rattle down. Oh. I guess putting it in the right way would help. So I just do that to keep the rattle down. And then I'll just put another one in. Like this, I mean, you, get a whole, you can get a whole roll of these for relatively cheap. What's it doing? Oh, the tab came down. So yeah, it keeps the rattle down, keeps it from scratching, and then I just keep one between the two pans here. If I can get it out. But you can use paper towels too. I just. I happened to see blue shop towels and I was at the auto parts store. Ended up getting one for the truck, just to keep in the back. I just put the kettle down in there. This is a little uh, steamer grate I picked up at uh, Asian Market. And then it just comes with the uh, cutting board and the frying pan. And it makes it a nice, convenient little package. And you just slide the whole thing right into the bag. And I actually did have a, uh, a keeper that goes around the set, but I think I set it down on the table and it got mixed up with some other junk. So, pretty nice system, I think. 